What's up everyone, Kodo Lewis here back with some more Sunhaven content for you. In this one we're going to be doing a fishing location guide on all the fish in the game pretty much. Well, not pretty much, definitely all of them. So I've got a list here drawn up, we'll go over the list real quick. Um, then I'll definitely have the list down below in the comments where you can, uh, in the description, I mean, where you can download it for yourself and then you can have it at all times. You'll know where to get any of the fish. And that's, yeah, that's pretty much it. And then I'm also at the end, towards the end of the video, after we're going to, first we're going to go over the fish. I'm going to show you. And then we're going to go over where these locations actually are. That way, if anybody's confused on where they are, and I'll show you where I prefer. There's, there's, you know, there's plenty of spots to fish. You know, there's three or four spots you can fish within, like, the farm area between the town and the farm and stuff like that. But where's the best spot? You know, where's, where are you going to get the best spawns at as far as, like, consistency that's what i'm most worried about when i say the best spot i'm talking about constant fish spawning i'm not having to sit around for five minutes waiting for a fish silhouette to pop up because that's pretty annoying when you have to deal with all that but anyways let's go ahead and get into this list but if you haven't already make sure you hit the like button if you're enjoying this video or if you enjoyed it at any point in time and make sure you hit the thumb or hit the subscribe button also if you uh, enjoy the video so let's get into it like i said yeah let's get into this enough messing around all right, so here is the list I'm talking about. I'm just going to scroll down. I'm not going to read these for you. You can just uh, pause the video and check them out for yourself. So these, uh, the bolded right here, the bold text is the area. So the Sunhaven town slash the farm in Sunhaven. These is where, that is like where you can actually catch the fish. And then these are the fish that spawn there. And then, of course, we have the new fish. These are of the new update. And if you're interested in checking out any of these new fish in the new update, I have a video on that as well that I just got done making. It's going to be in the cards. Check it out. It's going to be on all 40 new fish. There's 40 new fish, guys. 40 fish. 20 in Withergate, 10 in Sunhaven, and 10 in Novari. If you're interested in seeing what they are, and I'm going to re I read the descriptions on all of them and everything, go check out that video. And I'm also going to make a just a Dynas fishing altar video too because you can see some of these are in the altars. I'm going to make one of those. And it's just going to be pretty much the same thing as this but only have these altar fish to help anybody out who needs help with the altars. So moving on, next we have this right here. Here's the next section. It's going to be the wilderness east and the forest west. Basically pretty self-explanatory. Then the next area we have Nelvari, which is the Nelvari forest. And then we have the Nelvari town and the farm. And finally, we're getting towards the Withergate area. We've got the sewer, and then we have the Withergate town. And the very last thing we have is Withergate Forest. All right, now that we've got that cleared up, let's go and actually check out where these places are and where the best fishing spots are. So for starters, let's just start out with like the farm. I'm not going to go through where all the spots to fish at on the farm. You know where to fish at on the farm. It's any other area where there's water on the farm you can fish at. Right there's a fish right there. I don't personally recommend fishing on the farm. I also don't recommend fishing in the town because... Now, if you're lucky and you can get a lot of fish spawns, go for it. If that's your preferred spot, go for it. But me, personally, I hate fishing in the farm. And I hate fishing here in the town in this area. So, in my personal opinion, don't go here and don't go to the farm to fish. If you want those town fish slash farm fish, go here. Right above the farm or over into the up and left or whatever. To where Kitty's shop is and June's house and then like the whatever you call that place that sells the wheat. The bakery, I believe. But anyways, yeah, right over here where we just crossed this bridge. Sometimes you're going to get some fish that spawn down here. Then you're going to get fish that spawn over here. And then we can walk... Nope, not over here, but uh, right up here. And you can already see there's a fish here. A lot of time you'll get a fish that spawns here. Sometimes you'll get a fish that spawns over here. You can have three or four fish spawn at the same time. Not very often that they'll have that many. And then you can walk up here also in your downtime to also look for fish. So this place has a lot of potential for fish spawn. This is where I got all, you know, well, for the new fish, there was only pretty much the koi fish that spawns here. So... That wasn't too bad, but if you're looking to get all the fish from the Sunhaven area, this is where to where you want to do it at. So, moving on to the next area, we have up next the ocean. The ocean also pretty explanatory, but there are two different spots you can fish at in the ocean that I would recommend. The first one, not the best spot I would say, is right here on your farm. It's on your farm, so you can't really complain about it. All of this area down here is fishable. 
every once in a while sometimes i'll come and stand over here on this platform and fish off of it but really i kind of prefer right here because sometimes you get fish that spawn over here too or even over here i've had some spawn personally i don't really prefer the spot just because it doesn't have a very high spawn rate of fish for me and i have all the skills and everything by the way so my fishing and my fishing level is pretty high my fishing got pretty far when we were doing all this fishing level 60 fishing we almost got maxed out we'll definitely get it maxed out here soon but anyways here is where i would recommend fishing at on the beach if you're looking to get the ocean fish and do all the ocean fishing you can already see here's a fish right here just they're gonna be a fish will spawn over here to the left they'll spawn over here to the right and then down right here in the front sometimes you can actually have three or four fish spawn and they spawn pretty consistently and that's why i prefer this spot all right and let's go ahead and check what we have next on the list just a second we are on we've got the town and farm cover we've got the ocean cover now let's go to the wilderness east and the forest west so basically the wilderness east and the forest west are pretty much the same it just depends on which one you like better personally i'm gonna say i don't really care much for this first one that we're gonna check out and that is the east the wilderness east i just don't see there being very much potential there i don't prefer to fish here all right moving along just a couple minutes or a couple seconds here guys just give me some time to walk over here so here's a decent spot right here you can fish but i don't really recommend it because there's not too many fish that spawn there that's the only problem but if you're lucky sometimes you can get some decent spawns there the spot I'm going to recommend here is a little bit further in, and you'll see it here. Oh, nice manatome. And that's another good thing about being in the forest. You can get manatomes, so got to love that. Whoops. little confusing on where it is, and then that's completely my fault for just not knowing where I'm, exactly where I'm going. But I do know where it is. It's just here it is. This is the area I believe that we're looking for. yeah so okay we've got pretty much this whole stretch of water down here all this right here you can sit on this bridge and farm i don't mean or fish i'm sorry but i don't 100 percent prefer that sometimes if there's a lot of fish spawning up here i will but i'll go back and forth between that spot and this spot over here towards the bottom it's all pretty much connected in one big go i prefer this spot right here a lot of time you'll get a fish that spawns right here you'll get one that's right here and sometimes right here you can already see one just spawn down here so but that whole river right here is a pretty decent fishing spot. So that's where I recommend fishing here for the East Forest. Now let's go ahead and move on to the West Forest. So just one second and I'll let you know when we're there. All right, so now we're heading to the West Forest. We're just gonna go straight left to the West and it's gonna be this first little, not this area here, but the first little area where it actually kind of turns into the forest area. With the trees and the, the water basically it'd be real obvious because it's the only spot that has water that lets you fish here so it's pretty obvious where to fish but i actually prefer this spot over that one we just covered in the what was that the east forest this is the west forest yeah right here is where i like to fish there's a fish right there already you can get a pretty consistent spawn that's why i love this spot a lot of spawns here the only thing that i don't like about this spot is a lot of monsters but they're weak they're super weak monsters you can and usually if your monsters or if you're really low level and the monsters are bothering you stand down here by these mushrooms and you can pretty much cast high enough to not even have to really worry about it between this spot right here and if you can jump over here and maybe maybe not that side that looks like they're gonna follow you so but but, but right here you can easily get to them and without having to worry about that but that wouldn't be that big of a deal. I mean, those are really easy, weak monsters anyways. So moving on to the next area, let's go to Nelvari now. So in Nelvari, this is a spot I kind of recommend, but I kind of don't. This also goes in with the last spot we had. So this spot is unique because it's the only spot in the game that I've found so far that actually allows you to get two different area spawns at once. You're going to not only get the fish from this biome over here the forest biome slash wilderness biome but you're also going to get the nelvari forest spawns here too it's just going to be a mixture sometimes sometimes you're going to get 
the a lot of times you're gonna get the fish from over here and then a lot of times you're gonna get the fish from over here that's the only reason i don't really recommend this spot it does have a good spawn right don't get me wrong it's a good spawn spot it's a good fishing spot but if you're specifically trying to get fish for the forest or if you're specifically trying to get fish for an alvari it can be a little bit annoying because it's going to give you a little bit of both so with that in mind let's move on to the next spot this is actually the spot I prefer to fish at here in the Nilvari forest. This is the perfect spot. Honestly, it's my favorite spot out of all these spots here. If you're going to fish and just try to probably level up fishing just by fishing a lot, it's right here. This all you do. Just sit right here. A lot of times I would just sit here and cast this bubble thing, but every single time you'll have one to three fish spawn right here in this little area. No walking. That's why I love this spot the most. No walking whatsoever. You stand right here. It's guaranteed that fish are going to spawn like right here, right here, and then like right over here. That's it. Just in this one little spot. So that's why this is my number one fishing spot right here. Definitely recommend checking it out. But moving along, let's go ahead and go to the Nelvari Town. Pretty self-explanatory on Nelvari Town. There's not a whole lot of spots to fish at there. And of course, the Nelvari Farm too. I'm not going to cover the Nelvari Farm fishing spots. It's basically the same thing as the Sunhaven Town fishing spots. Pretty much anywhere there's water, you're going to get a fish spawn. Just walk around the farm and get them. The only reason I don't really like those that much is because you, it's a lot of walking. You have to constantly walk around to find the fish that spawn. But that's why... And this, this one is not much different. There's still a little bit of walking, but it's not as much. So we can get fish that spawn over here to the left. We can get fish that spawn over here to the right. And then also up here to the top right, there will be some fish that spawn over here every once in a while. And then right down here is also a spot where one or two fish can also spawn. So there's about four or five to potential fish spawn spots here. So this is a really good spot for the Nelvari town fishing. So if you're looking for the Nelvari fish in the town, this is where you're going to want to go. So I believe that only leaves us with Withergate left on the list. Let's go ahead and look. Yeah, we gonna, we're going to go to the sewers and then the Withergate Town and then the Withergate Forest. And we'll show you the best spots for those. Alright, so let's go ahead and head over to the Withergate Farm. And if you're still watching this video, guys, make sure you hit the thumbs up. If you're still in and you're enjoying this, hit the thumbs up. If this is helping you out, hit a thumbs up. If it's... If you want to see more guides like that, hit that subscribe button. There's going to be tons more guides. We're going to do more fishing guides and stuff like that. Like I said, I got that fi the video on showing you every fish in the game and everything like that. I do all kinds of Sunhaven guides. So if you're into Sunhaven guides, definitely going to want to hit that subscribe button. I'm trying to push that pretty hard right now <laughs> because I just want to get it to those 250 subscribers, reach that goal. And I mean, I'm putting a lot of work in for these videos, so I just think that that just helps us out i mean let's let's go ahead and just put it out there we'll hit that subscribe button so anyways let's go ahead and stop whining about that but let's get into this pretty much the sewers like i said there's no reason to talk about the sewers again there's it's right there that's where you're gonna fish at for the sewers it's obvious pretty self-explanatory and then for withergate I'm gonna, f you're gonna fish right here. This is the best spot in Withergate, right off this little dock. You're gonna notice a lot of these spots. If they have a little dock like this, these are gonna be good spots. These are specifically designed for fishing, obviously. They just have higher spawn rates. You can get like four fish sometimes spawning up and down here. So definitely highly recommend this spot for the Withergate Town fishing spot. Now next, let's go ahead and zoom over here to the Withergate Forest. That's what it's called. Yeah, Withergate Forest. So basically the spot down here that I recommend is right over here on, a, I believe it's on a bridge. Yeah, right here on this bridge. Usually I just hang out down here and there's like two fish, maybe three that can spawn down here. Every once in a while one will spawn up here as well. And it's pretty self-explanatory, you know, fish here, fish there, get all kinds of fish. But really that's all we had for you in this guide. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Like I said, if you stuck around to the end, Make sure you hit the thumbs up if you enjoyed this. Uh, if you got any useful uh, info out of it, hit that thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button. I'm trying to push those subscribers, guys. Definitely appreciate all the love we can get for this channel. Pretty much all we have for you in this one, though. So, I'll see you in the next one.